Big news for parents of children with ADHD, Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder, a new study revealing they can be treated without drugs by retraining their brain. And ABC's Rena Nynan has that story for us. This may look like just another video game, but it might be the answer to curing ADHD for 13-year-old Devin Coons. Six million kids in the U.S. are like Devin, diagnosed at the age of seven with ADHD or attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, struggling to concentrate throughout the day. Definitely really hard to, you know, stay focused. But now, researchers at Ohio State's Wexner Medical Center conducting a study by using video therapy to teach children how to control their symptoms just by using their mind. Just try to relax. We attach sensors to the scalp that picks up the natural electricity in the brain, and we train them to speed up their brain waves. Devin must concentrate to keep the spaceships flying where they should. I'm feeling a little tired today. An exhausting task for someone learning how to retrain their brain to focus. 3.5 million kids in the U.S., including Devin, are taking medication for ADHD. His mom hoping, with the help of this study, someday he won't have to. I think that he's perfectly capable of doing a lot of those things on his own, and I think that this study has the potential of helping him see that. The medicine definitely, you know, helps, but I would love to get off of it. I would love to be my own person. More than a hundred billion dollars are spent on therapies and drugs for children diagnosed with ADHD. And just like Devin, the vast majority of families would actually prefer getting off these meds. Oh, I'm sure they would. And research is why they are very hopeful about this promising research. They are because with the video games, they can actually see whether the kids are focusing and if it's working. Oh, that's great. Can I just say I love waking up with you in the morning? Oh, I love you and TJ. Up with oh my us. gosh, you, you, you just set the tone for the day. I love that. Thank Robin. you, Rena.